don't know why, but I think this guy is working for Bowser. You know, because he's got like the spikes and stuff, and it's it 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 it's starting to scare me a little bit. <laughs> but hey, how's it going? Yeah, you. Welcome back to more Pokemon Emerald is a nerd. In the last episode, we took care of Glacia, the Ice Stand member who wasn't as annoying as <clears throat> Phoebe. This episode, we can take on the final Elite Four member. Who the hell are you? But first, before I do that, let me go ahead and swap over to another Pokemon. Uh, Ash Bear hasn't gotten much of a sight yet, so um, out of all the five team members, uh, I think Ash Bear needs this the most. So um, let's go ahead and talk to him. I be the last of the Pokemon League Elite Four, Drake, the Dragon Master, and the natural sight Pokemon are wild living demons. They are free. At times they hinder us. At times they help us. For us to battle with Pokemon as partners, do you know what it takes? Do you know what is needed? If you don't, then you'll never prevail over me. That was actually poetical. But, don't be too loud. This is the Elite Four member Drake, the Dragon Type Master. Ice times are recommended for this one. If you have a Dragon Type, yeah, you might want to be a little bit worried, but because Dragon Types are super effective against each other, that's the only time, with the exception of. Well, ghost types too. But ice types are really recommended. If you got any steel types, these are great too, even though some of them have moves that can prevail over ice and fire types. So in that case, you should probably teach ice type moves to non-ice type Pokemon, or if you're like me, you know, go for other powerful moves. So anyways, you can start with a Shellgun level 52 with the moves Dragon Claw, Rock Tomb, Protect, and Double Edge. Uh, just be careful of Double Edge if you have a uh, one that is actually frail in defense. But, uh, if you can't, like... But... Okay, good thing I predicted that Protect, but... I just lost my place, you know what? Let's just move on. Pretend I didn't say anything! Anyways, I think I'm gonna send him just a couple of Call Mines here. Um... I don't know, maybe Michael might go Frog Tomb, but if it does, good thing I have Rest, because... I, well, that, that probably might actually kill me. Uh, I hope it doesn't. Wait, 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 what am I talking about? Rock Tomb is like a 50 power mood or something. I think it's 50, I'm not sure. But it is- Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. You're, yeah, yeah. Huh. Okay, it's still left. Good, 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 good. I was right there for a moment. It- I know Gardevoir is, like, not the best in defense. Like, I think Alakazam is, like, the only psychic type that has, like, even weaker one. Even weaker, um... Defense? I'm not sure. Completely. But he's gonna stab his Flygon. This Flygon is at level 53 with the moves Flamethrower... Earthquake, Dope, Dragon Breath, and Crunch. But since we have Ludicola in the party, um, I think the only moves they'll do are Flamethrower and Crunch. Or, or Dragon Breath, that might be horrible. But, um... Let me mimic it in case it does like, use Dragon... Oh, Earthquake. Oh, crap, that wasn't what I wanted to mimic, but you know what, whatever. <laughs> we'll mimic something, at least. I wanted to mimic Dragon Breath in case, you know, there's any additional Dragon Dice that would actually lift my Ice Beam. <laughs> that would help, but you know what? Whatever. Oh. And you're faster, but this isn't gonna do crap. Even though I'm not that great in defense, at least I'm not very effective. At least it was very effective. So take a nice beam to the face and good night. And if you don't, if you live, if you do, okay, you didn't live. Good, good, good. good. Ground and dragon plus a nice type. It should not be able to live that. Uh, most of these are quite weakness to well, three out of the five. Uh, it's gonna send an Altaria. Um, do I want to swap out? For the time being, yes, because. Um, this Altaria is at level 54 with the moves Double Edge, Dragon Breath, hold on, Dragon Dance, and Aerial Ace. Um, so I think my best bet, because that's Aerial Ace, is not going to any Pokemon that I re read to Grass types. So let's go, let's go ahead and shift down to Skrillex, and I guess I'll heal Agua. Um, I think I have one more Hyper Potion left. Surprisingly, I haven't used that many um, the items yet. I haven't used, like, well, I had to use, like, a couple of restores. That's pretty much about it, uh, amount of, uh, hyper potions. So let's go with the second best thing, let's go with, the uh, max potions right here. And what are you gonna do? You're gonna use Dragon Breath. Oh, okay then. Um, that critical hit. Oh, crap. That's this is oh, no! Me and my mouth. Just what I have to say. Me and my freaking mouth. We are arch enemies here. I don't know. Okay, good. I thought you were gonna get paralyzed for a moment. Um, but I got a bad feeling. I'm gonna have to use a lot more for for Starch, which is gonna be fantastic. Um, let's fly. 
It's fine, unless you're paralyzed, which I hope you're not. Oh gosh, please don't be paralyzed at this time. Please, 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 please. Thank God. <laughs> Just thank God. Oh, happy joyful day. That would have just sucked if I had just been paralyzed at that moment. But let me go ahead and use another full restore, but that was kind of completely unlucky and completely unnecessary at the same time. Yeah, I did not want to get paralyzed at this time. Okay, good. If I, if I, if it hadn't been paralyzed again, I would have taken a rage on something. It would have not been pretty at all. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that doesn't do much, even though I'm a steel type. Well, it actually does something, even though I'm a steel type. Then again, we can't rely on Skarmory's, I mean, Skrellis' special defense, I'm sorry. Um, but I know this poison should be able to do something, um, at least some amount of damage to the uh, Altaria here. Let's see, okay, good, it didn't miss. <sighs> Started where there, after, like, that big freeze right Oh, no, wait, it's not choke here. How come we could've just swapped out of that? Like, seriously. But no, he has to go for another freaking full restore. Like, really? You could have just swapped out to begin with. Well, this is probably going to give me big problems. Uh, the Saltaria, which is kind of depressing. <laughs> um, I really hope I can get this fly off. Please don't paralyze me. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have said that loud, but, you know. Okay, good. Just me saying, please don't paralyze. It doesn't it jinx itself to thinking I'm paralyzed. Oh, uh, wait. It doesn't jinx me into anything! Hopefully it doesn't jinx me into anything, am I saying that? Okay, it is Lotaria still poison. Nice, um, nice, nice, okay. So let's just keep using fly and. Oh gosh, it's gonna be. Oh, ha 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 ha. 23 HP! That's how epically winning I am. Oh, uh, great, you're gonna use another. No, you're not! Okay, that's surprising. Oh, uh, if you missed, though, the poison would actually killed it. So, ha 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 ha. One less Pokemon to deal with. And great, he's sending out his big weapon right here. This is Salamence, probably one of the more annoying Pokemon. Level 55, Flamethrower, Dragon Claw, Crunch, and Rock Slide. Now, let me go ahead and... I really, well, it probably may not use a Dragon Claw, um, so I'm just better off using... Okay! When I try to copy Dragon Breath out of the... Uh, if it lives, I definitely, definitely want to uh, mimic the Dragon Claw, please. Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, no, I can mimic the Dragon Claw and go yet for yet another Ice Beam. Okay, no. Okay, perfect. It's mimicking the Dragon Claw, which is nice, which is what I want. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of damage. That's a, um, that's a lot for a Dragon Claw. And this thing is, um, very high in attack and very high in special attack. So this thing right here can be a little bit of a pain. Uh, Rock Slide, okay. That didn't even matter, because he would have died from the ice beam. Dead serious. Um, okay. Let's go ahead, and I guess we'll do another ice beam. Because I'm pretty sure, yeah, it, it's definitely... It can live, like, surprisingly up to, like, three Dragon Claws, which is... I don't know. I, I don't want to lie to... Well, Ludicolo's special defense is, uh... Almost reliable. We need Leaf Force, so good thing I actually chose it, and... Oh, it's almost a level 50, are you kidding me? Um, let me see how many pixels away from this it is. <laughs> I could laugh this. Okay, I thought it would be like... I don't know! I just don't know! I, I thought it would be like something a little bit more, but... Do... Yeah, you know what, I'm gonna use the Max Potion. I don't really rely on, at this point, Ludicolo's um, low amount of HP to actually take it out. Oh, yeah, this Kingdra has Surf, Body Slam, Dragon Dance, and Smoke Screen. It did not just paralyze me. Uh, and it has Smoke Screen, so Smoke Screen to lower your accuracy, which makes it even more annoying, and Paralysis from a Body Slam equals maximum trolling. But I'm surprised that Dragon Claw did a lot. Um, it's at level 53, too. Um, it has no items, and it's really a Swift Swim, so don't bring in Rain Dance. I advise you not to. And no! Why? At this very moment of truth, you had to get paralyzed. Oh, not again! Ugh, you're... This is, this is exactly what I mean. He is irritating as heck. Just irritating as heck. Paralyze me and you die. 
Okay, thank god. I thought it was gonna paralyze and be like, oh my god, I can't. Dragon Dance! That just makes the thing even more annoying. Double the speed! Double the attack! Well, sing. Raises the attack and raises the speed. This thing. <sighs> just needs to die! It just needs to die! No! No, do not get paralyzed. Woo! Thank god! <laughs> that was actually less irritating than I thought it would be <laughs> at the same time. It got me worried to death. <laughs> no joke. Oh. <laughs> and it would have been a lot easier too if we had Rayquaza because I can learn Outrages at level 70 when I'm checking down the entire team. Whew. You deserve it. credit for coming this far. As a trainer of Pokemon, you do seem to know what is needed. Yes, what a trainer needs is a bitch. It's a virtuous heart. That's actually touching. Pokemon touch the good hearts of trainers to learn good from wrong. They touch the good hearts of trainers and grow strong. Go! Go onwards. The champion is waiting. Wow. Drake is like the most poetic Elite Four members. This one is my favorite out of the whole Elite Four. Ah! <laughs> that was almost too close. That was like too close of a bond. <laughs> oh my gosh. Totally worth using all three full restores. It was worth it in the end. Um, now... Surprised I didn't even have to use a single revive. That's all prepared I am. Is there anyone I want to use potions on? Damn it. No one I can use potions on yet. Um, but... Didn't I pull out... Okay, I did pull out the Miracle Seed. We're going to be needing this on Agua. This is why I had to pull it out. Because the final one, uh, maybe a, a, a nostalgia for those of you who played Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Jeez, stuttering much? <laughs> but other than that, all that shakiness, um, it was totally worth it in the end, I guess. Um, yeah. That was actually kind of surprising. So, next time on Pokemon Emerald, we'll be heading over out of here and into the hallways. So until then, you guys, peace out, and I've got to get water. <laughs>